Hey guys, it's me, Vicstar123, and I've got some Team Model 1887 gameplay. Uh, the whole team must be using the model, and it's a shotgun that I quite enjoy using, although like most of the rest of the shotguns in this game, it doesn't, um, you know, excel that much, it doesn't have that much damage, I still enjoy using it. I think it's just the way it is, just the reload and that kind of thing, I mean... The akimbo models on Modern Warfare 2 were absolutely awesome, and um, you know, compared to them, this isn't too great, but it's still nonetheless fun to use. Um, just, just the way it, you know, you can just run around, just be really aggressive, as you see there. So I'm running the specialist bonus, and this gameplay is um, fairly good, but it has an unfortunate end. But that's a little bit later on. So anyway guys, what I thought I'd do with this commentary is rather than talking about something random, I'm going to talk a bit about the gameplay, how I use a shotgun and how it works out for me, you know, um, this is probably one of my more successful games with a shotgun, so I'm going to try and explain why it is like that, and as you can see, generally I'm sticking to the edge of the map, I'm going to pop out here and um, I spot a guy in the distance over there, so I'm going to, rather than running straight across the middle of the map towards him, I'm going to stick to the outskirts of the map, which is what I usually do, and then picking up, pick him up just coming around here, uh, don't go running into the airstrike, just step back for a second. And as you're going to see, I'm always sticking to the edge of the map where there's cover. Just You can see here, I literally stick to the wall. Then I pop around this corner. There's a guy down there. Rather than running straight down towards him, I, I think about it, but then I turn back. What I'm going to do is I'm going to head through the buildings to try and get up behind him or beside him and take him by surprise with a shotgun. But then my team said that he'd been taken down. So again, I predict where their next spawn is going to be. There's one red dot there, and my team had the other side, so... That gave us a really good opportunity to, well, gave me a good opportunity to predict the spawn and then head up towards it. And again, I'm not going to go running straight in, even though it flips there, but um, sticking to the buildings, waiting. And then here, this is probably um, you know a bit of a risk, just rushing out there. But again, I'm just. You'll notice that I use kind of the same routes around the map, just making sure. Um, I only spot the person that I'm going for at the last possible second, so using my shotgun I can use that to my advantage, and it does hit marker a fair amount, so um, it's very important to weigh up where you're going and what situation you're about to go into, just make sure you get into cover, you've always got a room like this one that I can just dash into or I start getting shot at from long distance, and you know, you'll know you notice I've been on kind of the same cycle a few times already, and you've got to kind of learn a cycle that's going to work, and it's only through trial and error, but with shotguns, you just need to be able to sneak in and out and around. And yeah, there's always a doorway to dive through, and then every so often just reverse the route around the outskirts of the map. And the thing is, this doesn't only work with shotguns, it works with pretty much any weapon, but shotguns it's especially important because you really don't have that range, so it is really important. And I was 13 and I was really going for that Moab here. I really want to get one in the Team Random Weapon gameplays, but it's much harder than you'd think when you're playing a 75 kill TDM with five other good players, so... Um, I was really hoping for it and then lag out and I was like, no, oh my god, my, my rage, my rage at that point. I'm not sure if it was my connection or MW3, but anyway, that's the video. Thanks for watching. I guess we can call that a win because I was hammering those guys and that is just about it.